check out our shirt on Teespring. Folks, what's happening? What's going on in the world? I saw this movie on Showtime. I'm very much describe it as sort of this uh, comedy and drama movie called Everything, Everywhere, All at One. It came out in 2023. So the two directors of this movie is Daniel Quinn and Daniel Swire. Also, they go by the Daniels and mind they make awesome movies. Keep up the good work, guys. So the movie starts somewhere, anywhere, all at once, place, who knows where it is. Pretty much about these uh, Chinese immigrants, uh, they're trying to survive in the crazy world of the United States. Uh, they own a lawn mat. So they're running a lawn mat. The first floor is a lawn mat, the second floor is their house. So at this point of their life now, their marriage is failing, their business is failing, they're getting audited by the IRS. Also, the wife's father moved in from China because a couple years earlier, and he needs help taking care of himself. But only child, I guess at this point, the, the child's in her mid-twenties, she dropped out of college. She opened up to her parents that she's gay. She's trying to induce her new girlfriend into the family. The parents are not sure how to explain the grandfather about, the, about her girlfriend. So when they do show up, the wife tells the grandpa, oh, this is her uh, friend. So this is pretty much a typical traditional family, you know, so it's the old ways of living. Also, they're going down to the lighting mat, having these uh, flyers. Hey, we're having a Chinese New Year's at the lighting mat. You're all welcome to come. Um, firstly, before they have to go to the party and start having fun, they have a meeting with the IRS. Um, first thing, they're getting audited from the IRS, so they have a show up to receipts. So the, the parents go to the IRS, they take the grandfather in his wheelchair to it. They enter the elevator, something happens. The husband turns to her and, try, and tries to explain to her, I'm not really a husband right now, I've taken over this body. I'm from a different uh, dimension. And gives her a list of things you have to do to understand about this. And she has no clue what's going on. She follows the notes how to do this, and then she gets transferred to a different dimension. And her husband at the dimension kind of tells her what's going on. So the, the husband kind of tells her, hey, there's a war going on. This is like survival of all the multi-universe, and you got to do certain things to keep this going. And you're kind of like the savior in a way. This movie is a little bit of mix up the Matrix in a way. So he kind of tells her, you got to do certain things, advance yourself, because you're a different multiverse person, person, have different kinds of skills that will help you defeat the bad guys. So you do these little certain things, right or wrong, if you, just turn, what, you get the skill from that person, or you slip into that multiverse, become that person. And one of the, uh, the turns out she was a famous action star. Uh, she never married her husband, because she never married her husband. She met this guy, taught her how to be a warrior, and then suddenly uh, she's in a bunch of action movies. Didn't want to leave this source, but their husband at the different multi universe said, you gotta come back because, you know, we have things to do. They have hot, hot dogs for hands. They have to use their feet for uh, picking up things and writing all that fun stuff you do with your hands. So that's pretty much best way I can describe this movie, if I'm really trying to describe this, this would be like almost two hours long, longer than the movie is. But the best way to describe it, it does have a uh, mixed feel to it, but at the same time, it has its own story, original story. A lot of things don't make sense, at the same time, it makes sense. I like a lot of mix. And the, the actors got to play the same character, at the same time play five char different characters, while they're playing the same character with different versions. That one is every time a character's different version of them, this decisions in their lives affects the other uh, universe. Uh, so my version of this movie is all about when you, you just keep thinking about darkness, doom, you just see the, the bad side of people, you just lose faith in life, you just give up. And you're just trying to find excuses, you know, why your life became that way and then a lot of times it's your own decisions why that happened it's not that one person and it's all that you know the word you know if if this could happen to me or this happened to me 
but at the same time you have to accept this is the direction of my life and there is hope to uh, accept you know changes and you know get out of traditions and become a better person and if you just feel yourself with depression and doubts you just surround yourself a big black cloud over yourself and there's no hope and a lot of people around you feel it and you don't see the general sense the, the kindness and love from other people all you just see is dark and gloom and so it kind of explains to you that uh, there's not dark and gloom you gotta look the bright side of life and, and learn and experience life because we have a short time on this planet like it or not and you have to open that door and then get accepting as things are and how can make things better instead of trying to blame people you know things you've done also you have to fix you know your physical and your mental health too at the same time so that's the best way I can describe it like and subscribe let me know what you think uh, this movie has a lot of great uh, it's comedy action flashbacks a lot of mixture of things uh, right now it's up against uh, Top Gun but my opinion this movie is a hundred times better than, than Top Gun it's the very deep meaning of it if you just you know go through the, the little craziness and weirdness about it and everything comes together and you understand why certain things happen you know that's my way of saying it so like and subscribe let me know anything maybe do better next time bye